Good morning. So this is just me getting out of bed and I like to start my day having some devotion, spending some time with God just to set the tone for my day. Then I make my bed and I head to the kitchen to make breakfast. My go-to is always, always avocado toast. I love avocado toast. And it's so easy to make. Then I log into Zoom for my first class of the morning, which is CCDP. CCDP stands for Communication Skills for Engineering Students, and we usually take it in either our second or third year. Mind you, this class is three hours long, and I had a class immediately after. Get ready for school, pack my bag. Now I'm set and ready to go. So my name is Alyssa, I am a 3D aerospace engineering student in Stream C, which is aerospace electronics and systems. And I am originally from the Caribbean, I am from Trinidad and Tobago, and I'm in Canada, so I'm like, I don't know, a lot of miles away. Um, I've been here for almost three years now, and I really cannot complain in so I'm officially headed to school and I'm just walking to the bus stop to catch the bus for school. And I live in the Algonquin area, so I usually take the 88. And today I'm going to stop off at Heron Bridge just because I have enough time to walk to school. I love being outside. So I got to school a little, a little bit earlier than I expected and I have an assignment to do at midday. So I'm just going to go and sit down, do that quickly, just finish it up and submit in time and then go to my 11.35 class. So I submitted my assignment thankfully on time, 11.41, but I still made it in time. Now I'm on my way for my class. So yes, this is an engineering economics class, but funny enough, my class is in the health science building. So after another three hours of class, I decided to go to the library and just get some work done. But on my way there, I saw that the bookstore had a sale, a crazy one too, and I could not pass up this opportunity. Not only do you get books at the bookstore, but you could also get merch, varsity jackets, hoodies, t-shirts, graduation gifts, teacups, pens, anything you could think about, the bookstore has it. Even snacks. The University Centre is the main hub for student life here at Carlton University. It houses a wide variety of eatery spots. Also, there are classrooms in this building and it is home to a lot of student services including Carlton University Student Association, CUSA. Whether you're from Africa, Asia, the Caribbean, wherever, you could definitely find your flag here. I wore my food and I sat outside to eat, but the bees were doing too much, so I decided to leave and just go to the library as I initially planned to. Then I met up with my friend who is taking the courses that I am taking and we just stayed and got some work done together, preparing for our midterm that we had the following week. I love the aesthetic of studying in the library, you know, it gives that serious student vibes and also has a nice view. But during fall and winter, it's usually packed and I personally don't like studying in busy places. So let me put you on to some hidden gems on campus for studying. Anywhere in the tunnels is a great place to study. And how could I forget the Women in IT and Engineering Lounge? It is located in the EDC, which is the Engineering Design Center, and it's a space catered specifically for women to study. It's a great way to meet a lot of other women in your field and connect with upper year students who could help you study for exams. This is hands down my favorite place to study on campus. If you decide to live on campus here at Carlton, there's also study spaces located on every floor of every building. Carlton has 11 residence buildings and students can decide to live in a traditional style residence like Lanark House, Renfrew, Lenox and Addington, Grenville, Russell, Glengarry, Stormont or Dundas. Or you could opt for a sweet style residence like Prescott, Frontenac or Leeds. In my first year, I lived in Prescott House and in my second year, I lived in Frontenac. It is summertime and it's a great time to be outside. However, during the fall and winter, 
The tunnels are your favorite place to be. The tunnels allow you to get from one side of campus to another side of campus without dealing with the elements of the weather during the winter. Coming from the hot sun of the Caribbean, tunnels are in fact my favorite part about Carlton. And I love to see the creativity on the walls. And as I'm walking through the tunnels, here are some tips that I would have given my first year self. Be disciplined and work hard. Never lose sight of your goal. Have a schedule. Schedule everything from classes to assignments, due dates, gym, any outings with your friends. Schedule everything. Step out of your comfort zone and make new friends. New friends will be the difference between feeling alone in university and actually having a good time. Get involved. Join a club. Join a team. Carlton has over 300 clubs and societies for students. It's also a great way to make new friends. And lastly, but certainly not the least, have fun. University years are the prime years of your life.